Hello everyone, my name is Troy, and as you can see, things are a bit different. Um, now if you look at how I have things set up, it is simply just removing my show stage and putting the light that I use right there, and of course putting my stand right here. So, today we have, um, what should I name this guy? Um... This is Lookout. So here we have Lookout in... That's some interesting stuff on my uh, Lego creation. But anyway, um, Lookout is some type of small patrol ship that you... Not, not... Of course, Cybertronian, it flies around. Uh, but, you know, it's... It's something. You got the cockpit right here. Um, can fold down his guns, which become his arms in robot mode, obviously. Um, and he's got some flame deco right there. You can kind of see the head in there, but, you know, I tried to cover it up. Um, obviously, these will become his legs in robot mode. And, yeah, but other than that, he's actually really cool. Um, this Transformer, however, is extremely complex. Um, I mean, he's much like, how do I say this? Um, have you ever seen a G Creation Ultra Maximus? The, um... The uh, G Creations version of uh, IDW um, Optimus Prime. It's kind of like that, um, really, to be honest. Uh, this guy is a big pain, but, you know, and because of that, I'm not doing instructions. And he's also, there's a bunch of complaints I have with this guy, but at the same time, I really like him. Um... So, for comparison, um, here he is with a cool little gun that I made, and I'll do a separate video on this, um, because it's actually really, really cool. Um, you can have it mounted like this, but if you don't want to, just move this out of the way, um, you can detach it off of its base, as you can see. Its base is really, really simple, you don't even have to have that piece. Um, you just take that and fold this around and fold that up and take the handle of the gun and fold it around and there you have some type of little combat pistol, which I think is really, just really, really cool. I, I, I sound really childish like that and you can can fold that up and make it look a little bit better but there you go um it doesn't really have any transformation aspect to, into it but you know it's 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 cool i really like it but there it is with that and now we'll get on to lookouts i believe that's lookout yeah let's get on to lookouts transformation like i said this guy's very complicated um, but we'll start out by taking the arms and throwing them outward and swivel the hands around like that. Another thing, this guy is very, very, very fat, um, which is rather ironic to his name because Lookout is like... Some type of quick and stealth looking kind of guy. And, you know, I just like how his name works with what he is. But, anyway. Um. Yeah. Now you have that. Um, now you want to go ahead and start working on the legs. So, to do that, you want to bring the foot backwards like that. Um, and then 
you can now bring his legs down on that. And I don't know why that thing looks there. Just I shouldn't have put that in there. As a matter of fact, let's just take that off and forget about everything that was there. Um, <laughs> uh, but now what you want to do is you want to take his legs, rotate them around like that. Mm, am I doing things right? No, I'm not doing things right. You don't want to rotate it around like I just did because I'm a big fool. Um, <laughs> what you actually want to do is you want to... Eh, maybe it's just a case if I just designed this wrong and I'm misleading people. Which is normal. I've done that before. Let me go grab some pieces. Because I mess things up and get this light centered. Okay, let's go grab some pieces. So what you want to actually do with this guy? And it just my that sounded like it hurt, but I'm sorry. Look out! But that's part of life of being Lego. Uh, but <laughs> and now what you want to do is you actually want to take these pieces put them on the back of his leg and what that allows you to do is originally they're on this side but you want them to be on the outside of him so everything should come out like that um that makes him have quite big legs but you know that 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 goes along for him being quite fat so there you go again do the same thing with the other leg and I'll do this uh with the other one just so you get better detail of it so I want to bring this around and you want to rotate it to the front uh you don't want to break that off, just for clarification. Actually, no, you don't. Never mind. All right. Get everything straight. And a bunch of things are breaking off right now, so please excuse that. But, you know, my Lego Transformers aren't the best secured. So, you know, deal with it. And if you don't want to deal with it, then... Why are you watching this video? Let me just ask you that. Um, so, there you have something done, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, what you want to do now is you want to start taking the top of the vehicle apart. And so, we want to bring this down. You want to bring up this piece and you can see how the head stores in there you gotta got a little stubby head there uh you can go ahead and bring that up like that and now as you can guess all of this is going to compress into his body and make him look fat <laughs> um so yeah there you go let's let's go ahead and get this over with so now I can destroy this guy after this video um no I'm kidding I'm not going to do that to look out just yet I might but you know there you go um so now what you want to do is you want to get this into there like that so you want to take the wings and well the sides of the body and No, you actually want them. I'm sorry, I'm a little lost because, you know, this guy doesn't come with instructions. And I made this guy and I just had him in robot form. And now I don't. So, yeah. I might have just screwed myself over, but there you go. 
And these pieces up here on the top are very, very loose. So now what you want to do is you want to... I'm not even sure if any of what I did was in frame or not. It might have been just over here on the dark in the darkness. But... All right. If you don't know what to do, just... Uh, you want to take these pegs out of this piece right here and just kind of collapse it into there like that. Keep on trying to bring this down. It's not going to go down uh, perfectly, but um, it will come down to where it kind of looks like that. So now you want to... Fold stuff up like that. Uh, bring in these pieces of the body. Bring the arms down. You can bring these pieces down to kind of complete the backpack. And there you go. You have a uh, lookout or watch out. Whatever you want to call them, look out or watch out, or you can call them whatever the heck you want to. But anyway, there he is in his robot mode, and he is kind of hard to stand. But once again, I'm standing. He looks good from the front, at least. Um, every other side looks completely, completely horrible. Um, if you will, I'm just going to rotate him. And he looks completely awful from this side. And make the back kind of looks good, but not really. And the other side, of course, looks garbage. But the front, of course, looks the best. So, there you go. Of course. As you can probably guess, this guy is very, very easy to knock over, so if you have a very uneven shelf and you'd like to display this guy, uh, <laughs> don't use that shelf. That's the best advice I have for you. So, yeah. I'm trying to figure out a way to make this look a little bit better, but... This is probably the best you're going to get, at least for now. Unless I do an update, which is highly unlikely, but, you know, that's, it's, it might be worth it. Might, might be, I don't know. Once again, I'm just experimenting, seeing what I can do to make things look better. Okay. And then bring these down. And that kind of closes in the gap right there. What I did is I actually took uh, my that ye uh, yellow and red head that I like ever so dearly. And I featured it in my last video, I believe. Um, I tried to take that and I tried to put it in here and it actually worked. Um... However, it just made this guy too impossible to stand. But anyway, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, and yeah, maybe I'll come up with something new. Maybe I won't. And yeah, so this is Troy signing out.